All right, ladies and gentlemen, who loves fast motorcycles? Not just fast motorcycles. How about the fastest you can ever buy? Mr. Dave Vantine, I still can't believe it. Your 577 rocket ship. The fastest motorcycle that will ever be for sale. Number three in the world. Yep is up on the market. Tell me about this awesome thing. Oh, this is a great bike. Uh, it was started by Puppet. It's the last bike uh, he built. Puppet, if you don't know, was a, the amazing chassis builder for all the top fuel Harley guys. Elmer Trent, I believe he built a bunch of Larry's bikes. Uh, he's just been a, 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 a just out front in the chassis department. Gary Clark actually finished his bike. Another legend, late legend, unfortunately yep. no longer with us. Right, but this bike uh, is super fast. Um, we've been uh, 378 at, uh, you know, it's a, probably an inflated number. It's at 229 in the eighth. I would say it's probably closer to like, you know, 210. Uh, it's been 577. Uh, and it's been 246. That's crazy. One of the first bikes in the five second zone. Did it with Jeff Pollard, also did it with yourself. It's a historic piece. Dave, I gotta say, this motorcycle, legitimately, probably worth 400, 300,000. You're blowing this thing out. You are really helping the sport and giving somebody an opportunity. At, right. what, what are we at now, price-wise? We have uh, we reduced the price to 159,000. Wow. Uh, that comes with a, a ProJack standalone, it's five grand. The, um, well, let's even back up part for part. What would it cost to build a new one right now? Uh, well over 200, probably 220, 230. Unbelievable. That's, you know, with one motor. And this is turnkey proven 577. Yep. Um, and I'll help uh, if somebody steps up uh, here abroad, probably. I mean, we'll have to see about flights and stuff. But um, I'll help ride uh, in the riding department. And my guys have uh, agreed to help in the tuning department. So we're hoping somebody from the States gets it here and helps continue to build this great class. Yeah, I think we, we need it. Um, there's some new bikes, Jimmy Brantley's coming back. But then again, you know, we did lose Corey. So uh, we could definitely use another piece, uh, to, you know, to have a nice four or six bike class. When could somebody take delivery of this motorcycle? Um, well, ideally, um, it would be uh, in Valdosta. But, you know, hey, if, if you gotta, if somebody wants to step up to the plate sooner, certainly uh, open to that idea. And I've talked to the team. If someone steps up to the plate sooner, uh, you know, we'll uh, we'll meet you at the track, and we'll we'll help you uh, get acclimated, uh, both in the seat and, uh, and with your crew. Very cool. Now, here's a big question for you. You're you're fearless. You've been doing this forever. There's a lot of guys that talk about wanting to race one of these, wanting to go 246, 570s, but it, it takes a lot of practice and a lot of know-how. Are you willing to work with that rider to help help guide them along if, if somebody? who's maybe new to the sport wants to try it? Yeah, absolutely. Uh, you know, for as much as we can. I mean, once we take the delivery of our new bike, but that's not till 2019, uh, we're available. If somebody takes the bike, obviously we're not gonna be doing much. So we'd be happy to uh, help out. Very cool. Now I see right now we're doing some round by round maintenance. You got you got a very talented crew. The, the veteran, Mr. Pollard, who certainly has put his blood, sweat, and tears into this motorcycle is working hard. What, what's the maintenance program like on this motorcycle? Um, we come back after every run, leak it down, make sure it's okay. If, it's, if it gets up north of uh, probably 18%, uh, we change motors. Uh, the good news is it doesn't hurt a lot of parts. Uh, tires, uh, tune up, uh, change the oil, change the spark plugs, uh, do the clutch work. Uh, and I just noticed I have to repack the parachute. And, um, uh, and that's, that's it, believe it or not. Uh, these, uh, I find uh, you know, we hurt way less parts than I did when we were, I was racing Pro Mod, that's for sure. Wow, that's saying something. So maybe even a little bit more, who would have thought Nitro racing would be a little more cost effective? Yeah, but. it's just different. You know, you spend a little bit more up front, um, but you don't hurt as many motors. Um, you know, because Nitro's, uh, maybe I didn't have it figured out right, but I heard, <laughs> I heard, a, lot I heard a lot of people with I heard a lot of stuff. A lot of people uh, heard we, a lot We of wear stuff. stuff out, but we don't blow it up. I mean, you know, you just need some pistons and some valves because, uh, like I said, it gets tired, but it's not blown up. Very cool. So again, guys, we got Larry McBride, who has the quickest motorcycle, Peter Svensson, number two. And right now, this could change. Vantai could go to number one, he could go to number two. But for anybody who wants bragging rights out there, third quickest motorcycle in the world. Dave, if somebody's out there wondering, what does it feel like to go 577? Is there any way you can describe it? No, it was an awesome pass. Um, you know, there, anything in the fives is uh, is really good. No, it's just it. You know, it's just a growing feeling. Uh, when you get the tune-up right, you know, it just starts and it just grows. Um, 
you know, you keep your head down and it's uh, it's good. If you got the, if you get, if the bike's balanced properly, it's nice and straight. Very cool. So thank you for the great tours. Your crew works hard. Dave, if somebody wants to buy this motorcycle, what is the best way to get a hold of you? Um, I would either text my cell phone at 315-729-8182. My email address is dvantine at vantine.com. D is in David, Vantine at vantine.com awesome and there's there's the spelling for vantine guys so all you folks out there watching it we've heard a lot of people talking about wanting to run top fuel now is your opportunity i'm telling you these motorcycles could go in excess of three hundred thousand dollars dave's blowing it out for about half of that even nitro joe nitro joe are you ready to part with this awesome machine I, uh, yes and no. I mean, I mean, somebody's <laughs> gonna get a deal here, right? I love. I want to see the class grow. That's that's the biggest thing. So I mean, we build a new one. Someone else rides this one. That's one more bike. That's an awesome thing. But at the same time, she's uh, she's quite the machine. I'd hate to see it go, but. It is what it is, you know? It's, it's good for the sport, so that's what we're doing. Awesome, well it's beautiful. Dave, thank, thank you so you. much. Best luck with the sale. Thank, thank you for everything you do for the right, sport sir. and the class. And we look forward to many right. years to come. Thank you. All right, Dave Vantine, guys, take one more look. Get a hold of them if you wanna buy this motorcycle. Don't miss out on your chance to make motorcycle drag racing history.